in Power BI service, you can schedule a data refresh. You have to log into your account, navigate to your workspace, and identify the semantic model you want the data refresh. I've identified this, I can refresh it here, or I can schedule a refresh. If I click on that, I have additional uh, settings. So I can make changes here based on the needs, the gateway, semantic model description, etc. And I can also edit the data source credentials. And also, if there are any parameters, they will be shown here. And also, we can toggle this on off button for the query caching. So I can just click on on it will speed up reports by caching the data so this is the additional documentation there are certain considerations and limitations for now we'll just skim through all the details uh, and uh, once we understand briefly we will just go back and make sure that it is on and click on apply my query caching is also there i i, I click on refresh i can pick a time uh, let me just pick a central time here central us time and central time click on that and also i can configure a refresh schedule i can do that here i can make it as on a weekly basis say every monday today is monday so let me just pick a time to i can add a refresh failure notifications as well i'll pick say for example 12 30 pm central time so if i'm happy here i can just make sure that i click on apply and uh, Power BI sch uh, start schedule refreshes on a best effort basis. You have to keep that in mind. If I click on apply, my refresh is in progress. I can check here. I can go back to the refresh history and see that it is in progress. So it usually takes about 15 minutes to an hour. So best effort basis, right? So that uh, I can go back now. I can see that the data the semantic model has been refreshed so i have the most recent data so this is pretty cool it took about 15 minutes for the data to be refreshed in my case it could be different based on your semantic model and other settings so that part of it is done so i can just always go back and look at the refresh history and ref data has been refreshed so that has been completed so from progress to completed it's it took about uh, 15 minutes for me so now that that is done, uh, I can always go back to my report because I want my reports to reflect the latest data, right? So I can just go back and look at the data, source of the data. Here in this case, uh, this is the 311 service request data. 1014526 rows are there. I can always go back to my report, quickly create a visual here, card visual, and drag my number of complaints. Those are the number of rows. So 1014526 is matching up script. This is how we can schedule a refresh and uh, uh, make sure that your semantic models are up to date.